Ended up on my back once again, and I ended up cutting that one with a vicious elbow. There we go. The blood was pouring out of Edwin Deweese's head so bad, he's actually covering it up with one hand and using his elbow with the other. That's something that an experienced seasoned fighter would do. At the end of the second round, I thought, you know, the win was pretty much mine, and uh, Dana came in and said there was going to be another round. The winner of this round wins the fight. I've seen it so many times where guy gets cut and he can't handle seeing that he's bleeding. Let me tell you what, that kid was so composed, he really pulled the fight out. I gave him all three rounds. All three judges scored that round, 10-9 for the winner, Edwin Deweese. I've cut so many people, and to see blood pouring out like that is just ridiculous. I think that fight should have been stopped. Yes, it was a very bloody fight, but you need to put it into the proper perspective. But the reality is, the amount of blood loss was not a risk medically. A cut during a fight is a problem if the cut is in a place that it can interfere with the fighter's sight. You can see okay. It's, if you can see okay, you can fight. The ringside doctor in this fight determined that that wasn't the case, so he let the fight continue.